Hi everybody, today's yoga class is for the love of the game. We're going to do yoga poses that are related to sports. We're doing 14 different sports today. So it's a lot more cardio, so do what you can. Stop and take a break if you need to. You'll recognize some of the songs that you've heard at various games and movies throughout your life. So let's begin by putting your feet on the floor, arms to the side and look up to the ceiling and down to the floor, up and down to the floor, tuck your chin, neutral position and look to one side and to the other side. Back to the middle, tilt your head, arm out to one side, opposite side, and palm up, palm down, and switch. Arm out, palm up, and down. Relax, come back to neutral and shoulder rolls back. Both shoulders up and down. Up and down. Hands out, close your hands, open. Wrist circles. Other direction, both feet out, point and flex. And ankle circles, both feet. Switch direction and relax. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, and if you haven't noticed already, I have my golf clubs with me here today because golf is my favorite sport. And of course, purple is my favorite color, so everything is purple. And my favorite golf head cover looks like my dog, Bella. So this is my favorite. It was a gift from my husband. We'll talk more about golf later. So let's do some kicks. And switch sides. Our first sport is going to be skiing. Switch legs. And get ready to hold your poles for skiing. Actually put your shoulder, your elbows close to your body. And Bring your leg up and switch. You can move your arms. We're cross country skiing. Pretend you're in the beautiful snow and it's not too cold. You can see the tops of the trees with the snow. You're high up in the mountains. And let's do our downhill skiing. So this is a little bit more flexible. You're gonna turn your waist and your knees. Remember to keep your feet and ankles flexible as you go down the hill. Don't keep your feet flat on the ground and go from side to side. We're going downhill skiing. And we're ready for football. Okay, cactus. This is our goal post. It's not cactus today. Here's our goal post and hold. And side twist. Back to the middle and twist. 
Pretend you have your yellow goal post. And what is your favorite team? My husband loves the Minnesota Vikings, therefore I'm a Vikings fan. Back to the middle, arms down. Let's throw the football. And don't make fun of me because I throw like a girl. <laughs> of course I throw like a girl. I'm a girl. And switch. Throw the football with the other hand. Pretend you have that football in your hand. Good, other side. Throw it. Other side, throw the football. And back to the middle. Okay, we're gonna run down the field. Lift your legs up, move your arms. And we need to block the player. Block the player, move. You need to be quick with football. Make a fist, block. Hands out, block. And let's run down the field again. Good, keep running. And goal. Hold your cactus. And tilt. Up, tilt, up, and arms down. Good, take a deep breath in. Exhale, getting ready to go bowling. We need to put on our special shoes. So we're gonna reach down, forward bend, hinge at the hips, hold on to your knees or your shins or your shoelaces and get those bowling shoes on. Come all the way back up, breathing gently. Tie those bowling shoes, chin up. Come back up, down again. You got your bowling shoes on and we're ready to bowl. Okay, get your hand down that big weighted bowling ball. Straight arm up, sitting up straight. And we're switching sides. Be very difficult to bowl with the other side because you don't have the strength in your arm. Hold on to that ball, bring it up. And now we're gonna pretend we're the bowling pin. Arms all the way up. And when the bowling pins fall, they tilt to the side for moon. Up and switch up switch up switch up and down deep breath inhale exhale good bowling again arm to the side and up Straight arm, up, and switch arms. Imagine that bowling ball going all the way down, getting a strike. Arms up for bowling pins, up. Get those pins down, up. Same side, up, and tilt to the other side. Tilt, and up, arms down, deep breath in, exhale. Get ready for boxing, put your fists up, protect your face, and here we go. We're gonna do forward punches. And right now, all of our names are Rocky. Rocky Balboa, go to the side, middle, almost everybody has seen Rocky, the Sylvester Stallone, back to the middle, arms to the side and rest, take a deep breath in, 
Exhale. Okay, uppercut, make a fist. Uppercut, switch sides. Make a fist, use your biceps. And one of the most famous quotes is Yo Adrian in Rocky. Okay, get ready, take a breath, inhale. Exhale, all right, side punch and switch, switch. And back to the middle. All right, punching. One of the most famous quotes from the Rocky movie, switch sides is our greatest glory is not in falling, but rising every time we fall. That was one of the quotes that Rocky said in the movie. And it's true. I love that quote. And relax. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Good job. Let's move your feet up and down. As a boxer, you have to be quick on your feet. Hold your fists up and move your feet. Relax your feet and punch slow. And out to the side. Keep your fists. Back to the middle, arms to the side and relax. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Fist, uppercut, switch. Move your waist. And back to the middle. Deep breath in. Exhale. Good. Okay, let's get ready to get on our bike. We're going to be on our recumbent bike, which is the one that leans back and the pedals are in front of you. And bicycle. Relaxing ride. Use your stomach muscles and smile and relax. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. And legs out for scissors up and down. And relax. Now we're going to get on our 10 speed bike. You have to lean over and hold on to the handlebars this way or this way. Hold in your stomach. Pretend you're on your bike. Holding on whatever's comfortable for you. Look to the side. Make sure there's no cars and switch. Come back, sitting neutral. Deep breath in. Exhale. Forward fold a little bit and hold on to your handlebars. Look to the side. Back to the middle and switch sides. Middle and back. Deep breath in. Exhale and bicycle. All right, we're ready to get in our kayak. Get to the neutral position. We're gonna bring the sun out. It's early morning, the water's calm. Up for sun and down. Inhale up for sun again. And exhale. 
Good. Get in your kayak. Bring your legs out. Point and flex. Point and flex and hold your legs up. Bring your arms up, hold on to your oars. And row. Row your kayak. And now we're gonna go to one side and the other. Put your legs down and row. And to the side. Alternate sides. Middle. And arms down. Arms up for sun. Tilt for moon. The day's over. We're done with our kayak. Up and switch. Up to the middle. Forward fold as far as you want to go. All the way up. And arms down. Good. Okay, we're ready to play volleyball. First thing we're going to do is serve. I'm going to throw the ball up and hit it with the other hand. Throw it up and hit it. Look at that ball, up and hit, switch sides. Bring it up, hit, throw the ball up and hit it. Throw it up and hit it. And come back to neutral. Deep breath in. Exhale. Good. We're working on our triceps. Hitting that ball over the net. In the middle. And twist to the side a little bit. Get that ball to the other side. Hit it to your teammate. And back to the middle. And arms down. Relax. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, hands together, clasp your hands, stretch, get ready to the bump the ball, we're bumping it over the net, ready, get your thumbs together, and bump it over the net, bump to each side, and to the middle, bump, bump it to the side, and the middle, side, Side and the middle. Side, side, and the middle all the way up. Arms down and relax. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Okay. Swimming. Swim forward. Slow swim strokes. It's sunny out, the water is perfectly cool. And let's go to the backstroke. Big or small circles, do what's best for you. Pay attention to your shoulders and arms. Do what you can. Backstroke and to the middle for brush stroke, hands together, forward and out. Forward and out. And smile. Feel those waves, the cool water, refreshing feel of the water on your body and the sunshine. The Arizona sunshine and heat. And relax. Deep breath in. Exhale. Shoulder rolls back. And smile. 
both legs out, point and flex. Got to move those legs in the water too. Up and down, scissors. We're still swimming. Hold on to the side, life force reach. Hold on to the side of the wall of the pool. And forward and relax. Sit up straight. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Hold on to the wall again. Legs out and sideways scissors. And relax. Okay, we're gonna be gymnasts now. We're gonna start with our warm ups and do jumping jacks. Both arms out and back. Out. We need to have a lot of good balance being a gymnast. And to the middle. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Let's get out of our chair and work on our balance. On one side. Outside leg, raise it up and hold. Back, shake it out. Make sure your weight is evenly distributed on the whole bottom of the foot. And forward, hold. Back, shake it out. To this side, keep your legs straight and lift. Very important to have balance. Back to the middle, shake it out. Okay, this time bend your knee. Get your balance, weight evenly distributed and lift. And back. Lift and back. Shake it out. Let's go to the other side of your chair. You need balance on both sides. Get your weight evenly distributed on your foot. Lift the other leg and hold. Back to the middle, shake it out, lift again and hold. Back, shake it out, leg lift out to the side, straight leg. And last one, shake it out. Bend your knee, leg lift, out to the side. And back to the chair, sitting in your chair. Get ready for baseball. We're gonna pitch the ball, here we go. Pitch. And yes, I throw like a girl, cause I am a girl. Pitch to the other side with the other hand. Good, pitch. Now we're gonna swing. So small twist and swing the bat. Small twist, do what's good for you. You don't have to go back very far. Hold that bat and switch sides. Hold the bat and bat left. Most people don't bat left. And run to first plate. And relax. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Run to second plate. 
and relax. Take a deep breath in. Run to third plate. And relax. Deep breath in. Exhale, we're running to home plate. Run, lift up your knees. And guess what, you're almost there. Safe. Good job, bring your arms out, bring your leg, one leg out. Safe. Yes, we made a home run. Safe. 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 And back to the middle. We were not out. Alternate. We were not out. We were not out. We were safe. Again, we were safe. And back to the middle. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Relax your shoulders and your arms. Deep breath in again. Exhale. Okay, soccer kicks. One leg out. Who's a soccer fan? Out and switch. Kick that soccer ball. And switch. And reach. We're gonna protect the goal, the soccer goal, and we're gonna reach. Sacrifice, put our body in front of the goal, and reach. Reach with your hands. Reach. Protect that goal. And back to the middle, up for sun, protect the goal. Bring your arms out, lock that ball up again for sun, and hold. Down for sun, take a deep breath in. Exhale. All right, soccer, when you get a pass, you put your leg out. So this is our hip hinge. Put your leg out and get that ball. Your teammate passed the ball to you. You're gonna get it with your foot. And switch sides. One more. And back to the middle. Kick again, one foot. Two times, switch, and switch, switch again, and back to the middle. I forgot to tell you my favorite quote in baseball is, there's no crying in baseball. That's what Tom Hanks said in A League of Their Own in the 1992 movie. That's, that quote makes me laugh every time. He's talking to one of the girls that, on the team that he's coaching, and he says, there's no crying in baseball. It's so funny. If you haven't seen it, I highly recommend A League of Their Own. So let's do sun, arms up, and down. Arms out in front. We're gonna play basketball now. Arms up, we're gonna get that ball in the basket with our tricep press. And lean forward a little bit. Forward. Get that ball in the basketball hoop. And arms to the side, shoulder rolls back. And dribble the ball. Dribble the ball on one side. Switch, dribble on this side. Dribble on this side. And switch. Arms up for sun. Get the ball in the basket. Tricep press. 
Lean forward a little bit. And arms to the side. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Again, take a deep breath in. Exhale. Good. Okay, arms out to the side and hold. Arms down. And get ready for the most relaxing sport, which is my favorite, golf. I have all my favorite colored golf balls there. My husband calls my golf balls Easter eggs. <laughs> I even have a giraffe golf ball. So those are all my favorite colors to play golf with so I can see my ball. So we're going to get in the golf cart. And we're gonna drive. Golf is so much fun. You get to drive a little car. And it's so relaxing. And then we're gonna swing our golf club. Make sure you keep your head down and swing your club. Bring your hips through and swing. And let's swing to the other side just to be even. Hold the golf club. Pretend you're golfing the other way. It's really awkward to swing the opposite direction that you're not comfortable with. Okay, we're gonna drive. Drive the cart again. And now we're gonna putt. So we've got our ball right down below, in between our feet, hands on our putter and move your shoulders for putting. We usually go a lot slower. Putting and back to the middle. Arms all the way up. Look at the beautiful sunshine. Let's drive the card again to the next hole. Turn in your waist. Working on your rib muscles for breathing, driving. Arms to the side for sun. Inhale up. Exhale. And let's swing. Hands on your club. Swing the golf club. And switch. Look down and switch. Good. Arms up for sun. All the way down, forward fold. We're going to get the ball out of the cup. Hinge at the hips. Hold on to your knees or your shins or the floor. Come all the way up for sun. It's always sunny when we're golfing. And down, reach to get your ball in the cup, pick it up, arms out for sun all the way up, and down, reach to get that ball in the cup, your hole in one, come back to the middle, arms for putting, get your hands gripped on your golf club, and move your shoulders. Slow and steady. And smile. Because we're having so much fun in the sun. Arms up. Exhale. Hands on your knees. Inhale. Exhale. And remember, there's no swearing in golf and there's no screaming either. So when I have a really good drive and I hit the ball really far, I go like this. And I don't say anything because I'm supposed to be quiet on the golf course, but I get so excited. I just jump up and down like this and my husband is happy that I'm not yelling, but it is very exciting. 
So my golf story is I had no interest in golf ever. My husband has golfed since he was a teenager and I never wanted to play. I always had my own stuff to do. That was his thing. He did it with his buddies. And my mom said, you should really try golf. I think you'll like it. Why don't you just go to the driving range with Joel? And so I was like, okay, but I do not want to play. And I went to the driving range. I started playing the short course, the executive course, playing nine holes. And I absolutely love it. That was one year ago. In April of uh, 2019, I started, and I never thought I would say the words, I love golf, but I do. It's so much fun. So the moral of the story is you should always try and learn new things because you never know. And now I have my visor, my special golf shoes, my golf attire, all the cute little outfits. Of course, all my purple and the fun color balls. So I just want to leave you with my golf story because it's kind of funny. And um, just remember you're never, um, just keep your mind open to trying new things because you never know. I always say I'm a golfer now and I never thought I would be. So let's take a deep breath, arms out at your side and inhale. Exhale, hands together for namaste at the count of three. One, two, three. Namaste. Thank you, everyone, and I hope you loved For the Love of the Game sports yoga today.